What's wrong with this generation? 14 years old going out, drinking and smoking, getting pregnant and toking, focusing on the amount of likes you get on your profile pictures or Facebook stalking the people that hate you, maybe it's infatuation. Maybe if we stood up and walked away from the screens, it will build our education because the world revolves around money. And no one cares about the homeless. In fact, would rather buy a new iPhone than help out the hungry. Ain't that kind of funny. We get to sit back and relax on the benefit while other people are out there busting their asses for something like fair trade. And even though we're here relaxing, guess who gets the higher pay? And you think the government would do something about this bizarre madness, right? No, they're fighting between anti and pro, investing in weapons to destroy what is already broken, and rather than being friends, they're foes, and that's what's wrong with today. All the racism, stereotypes, and sexism is doing in my head, yes, I am fed up, because while everyone walks around with a smile on their faces, we know it's pretend. It's time we say enough and put it to an end. But we don't, because we're scared of change. Being molded from birth into someone you're not because that's what'll please society. Legalizing alcohol rather than marijuana because of tax, that's crazy. I myself am not a sheep. No, I will not go over there and take a seat because I know what is right and what is wrong. And although I've just accepted this, it's taken far too long. No, I will not change who I am to make you happy. I am me because it makes me happy. And no, I don't care about your statuses or your Snapchats of your party. In fact, I look at them and I feel sorry because while you're out there having fun, I know you're only doing it because you feel hurt, lonely or trapped. And don't sit back looking at me like she don't know anything about my life because I know you're full of crap. Why else would you want alcohol for your dull person at least? And no, I'm not hating. I'm reaching out my hand because I know what it feels like. From being overweight and caught a fatty saying that no one would love me made my breath tight so I said goodbye to food and hello to an ambulance to receive more lambs like anorexic or a freak. I could never win and it hurt. Maybe, maybe we need to think before we speak. We all need to stand together and realize what is wrong with society. I know there are more people out there besides me. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you, Tamisha, for your words of encouragement.